The state's public transport minister, Jacinta Allen, made the announcement today due to a number of interviews she says weren't conducted in a respectful manner. She says the interview with far-right nationalist Blair Cottrell was the final straw. The minister is about to join us live. This is what she had to say earlier this morning. People in their own home, using their own devices, using their own devices at train stations can watch whatever they like. But when it comes to standing on a platform, facing a big screen with content being shown, it's got to be content that's appropriate. The Transport Minister, Jacinta Allen, joins me live now. Thank you for taking time out of your busy day, Minister. I appreciate it. Why are you banning Sky News from train stations based on an interview that hasn't even been seen by commuters? Well, Laura, the, it really came to the point where enough was enough and even um, Sky's own news director has admitted it was wrong for that interview to go to air. But I must say, I have received dozens and dozens over the past three years um, letters, emails of complaint from public transport users who um, didn't want to see um, this content on the screens that are showed in, the, uh, in our city loop on our public transport platforms and stations in metropolitan Melbourne. And so following the events of uh, this week, I've decided enough was enough and have taken the steps that we've announced today. Minister, this content didn't go to air in the train stations. Mm -hmm. 